Tomorrow I have a bloom installation for a company holiday party. Super psyched about, um, but tomorrow's going to be a long day. Tomorrow is going to be a long day. So I work from nine to five, my regular job. Uh, I have a new job, you guys. This is, <laughs> we have so much to catch up on. All right, but yes, yeah, so I work tomorrow. Nine to five. The holiday party is at 2 p.m. They're allowing me to come in early to set up the balloons. Um, right now it's almost 10 o'clock. So I'm doing, <coughs> excuse me, four, hmm, I put three fingers up, four um, organic balloon columns and then a 14 foot arch. 14 feet wide, roughly six and a half, seven feet tall arch. It's an entrance arch for, you know, uh, the employees to walk under. So just give you guys a little look, a little behind the scenes. I just finished the balloons. Ooh, my phone going off. I just finished the balloons for the arch. I measured it out. Please don't mind this carpet. I messed it up my relatives my well, my dad's house um yeah <laughs> sorry god <laughs> all right these are my pvc pipes well my conduit pipes uh for my arch these are my poles for my columns and this is one two I don't know if you can see behind that three um, just organic garlands that I've made that I'm going to attach, of course, to the arch. So these are done. Now I'm going to go to making the uh, columns. Um, yeah. And then I'll bring you guys along with me tomorrow. Um, I guess to see how just to show y'all my day like this is the epitome of grind that shit out do what you gotta do this is a one man bandstand right now okay I, I wish I had this I'm not gonna lie this is a time that I actually wish I had someone um that also works with me or you know knows how to do balloons because even if i was just to blow them up i wish someone could be able to set them up for me like while i'm at work um i definitely i mean once i set them up it's for it's indoors so i know you know they'll last they're not going to uh what do you call it deoxidize uh you are going to i mean it's balloons you are going to risk some balloons popping but the good thing that i really do like about organic like balloons organic columns like even if one does pop usually the one that's right above it or the one that's below it just slides into place anyway and you don't even notice like seriously so i'm gonna finish getting the columns together because like i said it's 10 o'clock at night I already worked as well today. Worked, picked up the U-Haul, ran around to stores to make sure I had enough balloons to thank you, Jesus. I believe I am going to have enough. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm trying to knock this stuff out. I'll give you a video at the end of the night, I guess, once I'm finished everything, what the room looks like. It's 11.20. Wasn't that much longer than expected. So these were... The three garlands that I did for the arch in here is one, two, three, four base garlands for um, the columns. So all I'm going to do now, because I told myself I'm going to sleep at 12, that's, that's my cutoff time. So all I'm going to do now is do 
some smaller filler balloons to kind of build each garland, aka arch, aka column out. So that's it. I will, well, I wish I'd see you guys tomorrow, but this is going to be in all one video. <laughs> that's it. It is literally 12 o'clock, 12 a.m. on the dot. I did two large bags of filler balloons. That one has multicolors, the gray, uh, the silver, gold, and black. This one is just all black. I'm almost 100% certain I'm going to need more filler balloons. But like I said, 12 a.m. was my cutoff time. So I'm about to get ready to take this uh, probably five-hour sleep. Um, so that way I can get up and go to the setup. And if I do need more filler balloons, I do have extra balloons, so I'll just blow them up on site. <sighs> Good morning. I don't think you guys, yeah, you barely can see me. Turn um, right onto Fairbrook Road. Oh, but as you hear the GPS is on, I am headed to the venue. It is 5.15 in the morning. Um, yeah, so I will pick you guys back up. Once I get there. It definitely pays to be a little early because I was slowed up just a little bit. I actually got here at six, I mean at five, a little bit four before five thirty. And I had trouble getting in, sorry. Taking pictures with my personal phone. Um, like I was saying, I was having trouble getting in. First issue, well, not really issue, but first thing was the intercom for the hotel didn't work, apparently. Um, so I was trying to buzz in, and the front desk didn't see and or hear me for about five minutes. Um, so yeah, and then I had trouble getting in through the entrance, through the loading lock. She actually had to come back and get me base. The arch is gonna go here, and we're gonna do four columns on every other, I guess, post you should call it. Okay, so I need to get going, because like I said, after this, I am going straight to work. It's a nice, here's all my balloons. But it keeps on moving. I blame it on the model bra with the Hollywood smile. Strip a booty with the rack, rack, wow. I'll never forget ya. You put me on a field and I never had, never had, never had. And ever since I've been trying to get it back, you pick it up, put it back. Now I'm something like the chemist on campus, but there's no drug around.
Until my way.